Let's talk about beauty while I go get my food and go home. Had a great day, man. Columbus is pretty damn lit, for real. Let's talk about it, man. Because everybody wants the beautiful woman. But there's issues going on with this beautiful woman. Number one, the most high warned you that her beauty is vain. It means nothing. Absolutely nothing. Technically, it does, but it doesn't. It can get you caught up. It can it can cause men to um, simp for the woman. It could cause men to pick the wrong woman. It could cause a lot of things. It can also, and here's the biggest issue with beauty. It causes most women to fumble being a real woman. Let me say that again. Because I'm about to cook and warm up. Beauty costs most women being a real woman. Now, most beautiful women, they don't care. Because they're still getting thousands of men worshiping them in their inbox and all this other shit. But in the end, the devil got something for them. See, what they're doing is they're abusing what, what God gave them, which is beauty, right? But the Most High did not give these women beauty for them to, you know, hop on their stories and act like they're better than you and have you worship them like you're just nothing to them. You know what I mean? I'm also say something else. Yeah, she might be beautiful, but it doesn't compare to a man when a man is on his shit. And got all these things going for himself. And the reason is because all she can offer you is beauty, right? And you offer her everything else. Now, if it's a woman that's beautiful and she's trying to be a real woman and, and have morals and value and, and offer man shit, then that's a well, that's a whole nother topic. But again, most women fumble being that woman because of their beauty. What do I mean? Since she looks good, she never had to tap into being this real woman, like most women who don't have beauty like that. She never had to tap into learning how to cook or actually respecting the man or appreciating the man and all these other things because everything was handed to her on a silver platter because she looks good. Now, you can't blame the woman for this because it's really the man's fault. It's really men's fault for saying, for not understanding that it's really the men's fault for not understanding that the Most High told you that her beauty is vain. If you would have listened to God, if every man would have listened to God and say, "Yeah, you look good, but I'm not gonna put you on the pedestal," we we probably you see a lot more men with a lot more great good-looking women, not good-looking women. A lot of men got good-looking women, but great good-looking women. But instead, what you're seeing is women using their beauty. And things like that to their advantage to to uh, dismantle men, um, get over on men, shit on men, whatever. Get over on men, right? Dismantle them. And if you're not careful, a lot of you guys got daughters. And they see this. They see these women on these stories. Look at me patting their eyes and all this other shit. That ain't got shit to do with being no woman, bro. You got to stop giving them attention, man. Like Tupac said, oh, I should have played the damn clip. Let me try to find this clip real quick while I'm making this video. Let me try to find this motherfucking clip while I make this motherfucking video. Because y'all, man, y'all not. Matter of fact, I'll just, ah, I got it. Perfect. Here we go. Here we go. Pay attention, niggas. Because y'all niggas not listening. You, you just not getting it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What, what he saying? Niggas need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. That's why niggas is dying now. When these hoes get horny, niggas die. Hoes get horny, niggas die. Watch, every time. Big funeral you go to, it's a bitch that was horny the night before. So you need to start checking these bitches. Keep your dicking. Niggas need to go back to the OG penitentiary days and start jacking off. Because if you don't, you're going to end up killing each other. You're going to die. Fuck you might not die. Saying, you look. Stop giving these bitches all the attention. That's why you dudes might not die literally. 
but you're going to die on the inside. This is the most high God saying her, the God, the God that created these women telling you her beauty is vain. What do blockhead dudes do? Oh, no, it's not. I'm going to worship a woman who's in her story, patting her eyes and don't give no fucks about me. The reason why the women are doing what they're doing and think they're better than y'all and shit on y'all and all this other shit is because y'all have put them on a pedestal. If you judge women for more than just their looks, then you will come to find out that a lot of females are not really women yet. They can be. They, they got the potential to be that, but they never had to work to be that. And the reason why they never had to work to be that is because you men... You men give these women these wife passes just because of looks or sex. This woman didn't have to do nothing but get on social media, pat her fucking eyes, and, and you you men are acting like she's God. And she ain't done nothing. You're acting like she's your wife. She ain't done shit. You can't get mad at the women, though. It's you men. It's not the women. It's you men. I'm not telling you to get an ugly woman. I'm just saying don't let, don't praise a woman and put her on a pedestal just because she look good. It got to be more to it. Yeah, you look good, but what else you do? These good looking women got to do the same shit that the so-called, what you would call ugly women are doing. You got to cook and all that shit. You don't get no pads just because of your looks, but you niggas buckle like a bitch. Oh, I'm just going to break. She looks good. Man, her pussy could be trash. Because that's why you're doing it. She looks good. I want to fuck her so bad. Man, her pussy can be garbage. But you treating her like she's some fucking wife and she's not. And that's why y'all getting shitted on. Let's go back to the fucking video one more fucking time. First thing he said on the list, stop giving them attention that they don't deserve. A woman who don't want you don't deserve your attention like that. The guy that she wants, that's the attention that she needs to be seeking out. Not yours. But you guys are doing that because of what? She looked good. If she weighed 500 pounds and ugly, you would not be in her inbox like that. But since she looked good and patted her fucking eyes and showed a little bit of her butt, you're buckled like a bitch. Let's play the shit again. Niggas need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. That's why niggas is dying what? now. When hold on, hold on. Niggas need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. That's hold niggas on. Niggas need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. That's hold niggas on. Niggas need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. That's what? Niggas need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. That's they're what? Need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. They're what? Stop giving these bitches all the attention. Niggas need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. Niggas need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. Now, when these hoes get horny, niggas die. Hoes get horny. Niggas die. Watch every time. Every funeral you go to, it's a bitch that was horny the night before. So you need to start checking these bitches. Keep your dick in. This is coming from somebody who basically can get any woman he wanted, and he was getting them, and he's still telling you, stop giving them attention that they don't deserve. If they not giving you attention back, why are you giving it to them? Why are you giving it to them, bro? They laughing at y'all, man. These niggas is easy. How many times have you heard that post? These niggas so easy, girl. Yeah, because all y'all doing is putting them on a pedestal because of their looks. And their looks don't even define how good their sex would be anyway. Because and I say that because that's why you're doing it. You, you're 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 putting the woman on the pedestal because of her looks, and it's because you want to fuck the woman. But you're not realizing her sex could be garbage. And then some of y'all are doing it because you want a trophy. You're not realizing that trophy that you want. That girl might not cook for you. None of that, and still be sleeping with your man behind your back. Am I saying get a ugly a woman you're not attracted to? No, you should never do that. But you got to stop. Let Pac niggas tell you. Niggas need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. Niggas need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. That niggas need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. That niggas need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. That niggas need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. That niggas need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. That attention. That's why they on Facebook. Man, I have way more success from a woman trying to actually really like me. 
outside of Facebook. On Facebook, hell no. You know why? Because they know I make videos like this to wake men up. Because men got to wake up. You got to. Because if we don't wake up, guess who's next in line to be patting her eyes on some fucking story and not doing nothing that has anything to do with a great woman? Guess who's next? Your daughters. These are old women, they gone. We, oh, well, they done. We not worry about them. But we can save these younger women. Let let them understand what a real woman is. Even if she looks good, it don't matter. These other women's too late. But when are you men going to wake up? You the leaders. We are the leaders, not the women. This ain't about worry about what a woman do. We can complain about what women do all day long, but until we move a certain way, women are going to keep doing this shit. So I'm not mad at women. I'm trying to make men wake up, but guess what? Men are always going to buckle like a bitch and fall by the sword because a woman looks good or because of pussy. If you care anything about your daughters, then you got you to gotta fight this fight. That don't mean that you 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 neglect women or treat them wrong. You just stop giving women attention that, for one, is not trying to fuck with you like that. And for two, if she's not really trying to tap into what a woman really is. Hold on for one second. I forget the number, man. It's probably the separate fry and the... Um, you got a large medium shrimps. Huh? Large medium shrimps with a large raw beans. Nah. Yeah, with the separate fry. Crispy. Dog. $14, bro. Seasoning with man. Yeah, I need extra seasoning. I don't care about the fry. But the chicken, I want extra seasoning. Huh? Oh yeah, all over the place. That's some crazy shit on here too. It's got a camera here. Shows people walking past everything. Alright, Yep. Receipt, man? Nah, I ain't worried about it. You got some hot sauce? Yes, sir. And you like some ketchup as well? Mm, yeah, I don't think I got none at home. Y'all make the food better than the people before, man. The people who had it before. Oh, really? Yeah, they, I don't know what's going on with that shit. Nice, man. Thanks. You got extra seasoning? Yes, sir. You just put something? Alright. Uh, Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. Why, look, man, why y'all think most women don't want to act right or be this woman, this wife, until after she has kids and all this other shit, until she fell by the sword? Now, now, now she, now you're good enough. As men, we can't have that no more. We can't have, oh, have women saying, you know what? All men got to wait until I'm done being worshiped like I'm a God and I'm better than all men. Then I decided to settle down and have one. Nah. You gotta stop you gotta start ignoring them more. You gotta bring them back down to earth. Just like you do the women who don't look as good, you gotta do the same fucking thing. This is why a lot of times the women who don't look as good and they are better women, man. 
because they are down to earth. They have to deal with reality. A very good looking woman ain't got to deal with no fucking reality. Everything's handed to her. Everything, man. That is not a problem if the woman is a woman who has integrity, respect, and things like that for men. And she has earned that right by being a solid, real woman. But just because she look good, that's a problem. And that's the problem that's going on out this motherfucker. These women ain't earning nothing. They just look good. And what do y'all do? Y'all fold like a bitch. But when it comes to a woman that don't look as good, you, you don't give a fuck. You give no fucks about that chick, though. Why can't you keep the same energy? Why is it so hard to keep the same energy? I'm going to tell y'all a secret, too. You're not even going to get those good looking women unless you do keep that type of same energy that you keep for the women that you don't think is that looks as good. I'm going to repeat that shit. You are not going to get the fine woman and unless you come at her the same way that you come at a woman that you really don't think it looks as good. Because if you don't, she's going to think you're a fan. You're going to be nervous and all this other shit. So you might as well, all men might as well just stop putting women on a pedestal just because of looks. It's a win-win situation. Not only that, you're fighting for the future of these younger women. These younger women got to see that oh, I got to be more than just look good to get a man and be a real woman. It takes more than that. Until we start fighting back as men, they won't see it. I'm going to just put on some makeup and this and that and men bow down to me like this. That's all I got to do. It's not about it's not about the women who already fell by the sword. They're done. You can't change that. But what about the younger generation of females? Don't y'all men want them to understand what real women are? Now, we can't really show them, but we can lead by example of what we accept. Like, now nah, I'm not going to accept that. Just because you look good, I'm not going to accept the fact that you're treating me like shit or, or you don't want to cook or nothing. Nah, that's not what a woman is. I'm good. But y'all not going to do that. You're not going to pass on, on that good-looking woman just like these women ain't going to pass on the bad boy. They know the bad boy needs to be disciplined and shouldn't be rewarded, but they don't pass on him. So that's what y'all men are doing. I'm telling you, dog, these women are using y'all, man. They using y'all, man. All they doing is sucking up your energy. You worshiping them like you a bitch. I'm bi man. I'm a real man. I'm greater than that. If you're a real man, you mean to tell me that you're not greater than a good looking woman? Cause she look good. That's it. So you really you're gonna shrinkle yourself up in a little ass box like a little bitch? Oh shit! I'm in a box. Because she look good. And you wonder why they don't respect you. Even if I don't, I'd rather not get the pussy and get the woman's respect. See, y'all want it the opposite way. Y'all don't even care about the respect. You just want the pussy. Well, many men have got the pussy and not the woman's respect and got rape charges. Or got their head blown off. Or got STDs or, or child support. You know what I mean? Set up. So which one you want? It's time to wake up out this motherfucker. Fuck all that other red pill shit. Even though that shit's good too. It's, it has its purpose. But at the end of the day, man. What do you really want, man? I know what I want. I don't want to be played. I don't want to fall by the sword. Because, because I didn't listen to the most high when he said that a woman's beauty is vain. The creator of woman is telling you her beauty is vain. Because it has nothing to do with who that woman is. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. But she knows she can use that beauty to make herself a better woman. Even though it doesn't make her a better woman. What do I mean? This woman doesn't really look good and this woman looks good as fuck. But this woman is a solid woman. 
it's not even comparable. It's night and day. This woman is garbage when it comes to being a woman. And this woman's a real woman, right? But this woman can use her beauty to make men in a psychological mind think that this woman, this woman who is the bullshit is better than the real woman because of looks. And again, I'm not saying settle for less than what you want in a woman as far as looks. But you can't, but guess what? You can't settle for less just because a woman looked good to you either. I'm not saying settle for less than what you want as far as looks in a woman. I'm trying to tell you don't settle for less. That Don't settle for less than what you're looking for as far as a woman just because of looks. See, there's two things going on. Ain't nobody telling y'all to settle for women you don't think is attractive, but there's steps to this shit. A lot of y'all just folding because she looked good. But you knew she full of shit. You knew she liked to fuck with other men and shit. But she looked good enough, so you went with it. And now look, child support. Child support, uh, um, rape charges, whatever. Or even worse, you have a daughter by the girl. Now the daughter thinks all she got to do is put on makeup and pat her eyes and she's a woman now. Because men bow down like a bitch just because she looked good or put on some makeup. Man, this shit crazy, man. This shit crazy as hell, man. And what's crazier about it is you're not going to get that good looking woman unless you apply these rules. You def you're not gonna get the good look of one you're not gonna get the good look of woman how you want her to be unless you apply these rules. See, I can get a good look of woman all day long, but if I don't stick to my standards of what I want in a good looking woman, that, that's where you get the cheating and the disrespect. And I run him, he's a peasant. Look at me. I hold up a little man with my hand type shit. Bow down to me, nigga. You owe me money, rent money and shit. All this. This is what you get. But if you had standards, that woman could never pull that off, no matter how good she looks. A lot of men having a bunch of kids by these women and regretting it. They're not going to tell y'all that, but deep down inside, they regretting it. Because all they did was, was seen the woman look good. Oh, let me bust another in her. But what if that man applied some rules? Like, you know what? I ain't put, I ain't busting no, no, no woman until she proves that she's a solid chick. You see? Not just because she looked good. You got to apply these rules because that's the only way you're going to get solid women. If not, you're settling. I don't care if she look good, but I still smash. Yeah, but uh, her her looks don't make her sex good. So you still settling. You might smash a woman and look good, but her sex is trash and she's full of shit. You winning? That's what you call winning, right? I don't think so. I don't think so. I'm a handsome guy. The fuck a woman just because she looked good. How that put her over me? The only reason why she's over me is because of men. And women don't worship a man just because he looked good. Two could play this game. Women don't give you cool points just because you look good. I mean, it might get your foot in the door, but there's other good looking men to her too. She's not going to just put you on a pedestal just because you look good. Like y'all men are doing with these women. She's going to require all kind of shit. So why don't you as a man? Why don't you require the same shit she requires? What's the difference? We will have way better women if we had more standards. And not only that, the younger generation of females will benefit from this. Because they would understand that I got to be this if I want a man. Instead of all I got to do is look good if I want a man. Even though they still, even though these women are still getting shit on. I'm not saying men are innocent because they're not. Women are still getting shit on by men. You know what I'm saying? They still getting shit on by men. Even though all they got to do is look good to get the men. They still getting shit on. But. It's basically, it, you, we're de, we're de, we are destroying the women. To the point there is no good women. And let me piggyback back off of what I was saying. Yes, the women are getting the men just because they look, they put on some, they, they make themselves look very presentable. 
So yeah, they're getting a lot of men this way, but guess what's happening with, with these women? Why are they still getting shit on? See, this is a lesson for women too who want to kick against it and say I'm hating. Okay, get a man just because you look good. Watch. Watch what happens. Watch what happens when you get a man or attract a man over with your looks. Watch what happens. Because you're not the only one woman that look good. So for all the women who want to kick against this, it's it's really it's like I said, it's it's hurting you in all kinds of ways. It's hurting you from stunning you from becoming a great woman, and it's making you pick, it's making you attract men who don't see what real women are. Therefore, the next woman could come up and swoop that motherfucker. Even if you are a great woman, he picked you if he just picked you off of looks alone, and you are a great woman, right? It's not gonna matter because the next woman looks good. He's, he it doesn't he didn't pick you because you're a great woman. He picked you because of the looks. Even if you are a great woman, that don't mean that's why he picked you. That's the issue with it. That's why I keep telling men to stop doing this shit. Stop doing this shit, man. There's going to be way more good-looking women for you if you do. If all men live by this fucking code, all women would have to comply. They'd have to become better. You would have better good looking women not bad bitches that are trying to shit on you and run you because why would I act good why would I act right as a woman if all I gotta do is put on some makeup and these niggas are so easy girl that's what they say all they doing is putting on makeup and you treating her like a god so you're gonna get shit on she gonna shit on you dog I'm telling you that's why you can't do it don't twist my shit and say that I said get with a woman that's ugly to you. I didn't say that. I'm saying even if it's a woman, you like I like the way this woman looks. Now you got to see who she is as a person. You can't just stop at her looks. I don't think Jay Z stopped at Beyonce's looks. I'm sure he could probably get some women that look a little bit better than her. But guess what? What about all that other shit? See, a lot of men right now are, are suffering because they had kids by the wrong woman. Probably because of the sex or the looks. Let me bust another in there real quick. Can't do that, bro. Can't do that, bro. It's time to make these women start becoming women. When it comes to us, when it comes to men, you want to deal with me? Well, you're going to have to be a real woman. You're going to have to bring more than just your looks. Yeah, I appreciate the looks. Don't 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 sleep or get comfortable and become ugly and shit. Nah, don't do that. But you're gonna have to come with more than just looks. I'm tired of every time I log on Facebook, these women think they god to men because of because they uh put on some makeup and shit. You know you don't look no better than me as far as a man looks. Vice versa. You ain't no better than me. I'm handsome too. I'm not ugly. So what makes you better? I don't get any cool points because I look good. I don't see thousands of women in my inbox because I look good. Think about that. Think about that long and hard. Why don't it work with a man? If looks is so important, why don't it work as a man? Because women are not, at least women to that point, aren't foolish. They're not going to just put you on a pedestal because of your looks. Because they understand that they need more out of a man than looks. So why don't men understand they need more out of women than looks? I don't get it. I don't get it, man. And you can say all you want. Once again, you can say because you want to smash or I did smash. Her looks ain't got nothing to do with the, the experience of the smashing, dog. It's just not. You're going to find out that a lot of good looking women, they sex really ain't really was cracked up what you think. Man, I'm done talking, man. Let me get my shit, man. Y'all do what y'all want, though, man. Go ahead. Keep putting them on a pedestal because they, cause they look good. And they're going to keep doing the shit they do on Facebook every day. Coming to take y'all energy. Jezebels. Just sucking up your energy. Sucking it up. You men ain't shit. Give me your energy. Give me your energy, little bitch. That's what they doing. You my bitch. Give me that energy. And I'm going to go suck and fuck a guy who don't even pay attention to me. Little peasant. That's what she's looking at you as. And you okay with that shit? Man better wake the fuck up. You been you man better wake the fuck up, bro.
Don't hate women. We're, we, you're doing the women a favor when you do this. When you have standards and don't just settle for a woman who look good, you're doing them a favor in the end. And you're doing the younger generation of women a favor. Or your daughters a favor. So it's time to stand the fuck up. It's time to stand the fuck up. Well, how you going to do that, dog? We need women. We need women, dog. How we going to do it, Juan? We need pussy. This is how you going to do it, motherfucker. The cheat code, nigga. Niggas need to stop giving these bitches all the attention. That's why niggas is dying now. When these hoes get horny, niggas die. Hoes get horny, niggas die. Watch, every time. If you know where you go to, it's a bitch that was horny the night before. So you need to start checking these bitches. Right here. Cheat code, nigga. Cheat code, nigga. Cheat code, nigga. You're gonna end up killing each other. It's either that or suffer, nigga. Which one you gonna do? And tell women act right? Better stand the fuck up. You heard what he said at the end. If you're dealing with a real woman, it's all good. But if you're dealing with these Jezebels, oh, I look good, worship me, bow down to me, bitch, nigga. I own you, bitch. Give me your energy, bitch. That, that shit, you can't fuck. They gotta suffer. And how do you make them suffer? No attention. They don't even exist because that's how they look at you. You really don't exist to them. They just use you for the energy to boost their ego of the guy that cracked their shit. So the man that broke their ego, they use you men that they don't want to, to build that ego back up. Just to go back to the same men, you know what I mean? It, am I good enough now? I feel a little, maybe I, maybe I do feel good again. And then that, that man just crushed her ego again. And then she run right back to you to suck your energy to, for you to build her up again. Oh, now I'm, now I'm good looking again. Let me go get another man, j another man who don't give a fuck. Cause you know, they attracted to men who don't care, right? Let me go get another one who don't care about me just to get her shit crushed again. And a lot of those men don't care about these women because these women are using their looks to attract the men. They're not just being women, great women to attract the man. And they wonder why they get the men that they get. You're getting men that only appreciate a woman's looks or sex. So yeah, he's going to be here and there. If I'm a man that only appreciate a woman's looks or sex, shit, that's any woman. I can get that anywhere. But if I'm a man that appreciate all this other shit in a woman, a lot of women ain't doing that shit. So it's when you come across it, you, you got to appreciate it. I'm going to say that shit again before I get up out of here. A lot of these women getting shit on because they're dealing with men who only appreciate a woman's looks and sex. Therefore, any woman got that. Literally. Well, why these men cheat with dirty dick or these men cheat with, well, they probably do that shit too. These men cheat with ugly ass Felicia why men always cheating with ugly women? Because a lot of men only got with you or you use your, a lot of men only got with you because of your looks and sex or you use your looks and sex to get the man. So the next woman got that shit. But if you a solid last chick and you doing all these great things, he can't find that anywhere. Now, some men are going to be sneaky and still cheat and try to keep you around and all that shit. But you get the point, man. You get the point. And, and for y'all men kicking against it, all I can say is I hope you don't have daughters. Any man right now watching this shit mad at me for saying this truth, this real godly truth, I hope you don't have daughters. That's all I can say to you, bro. So you can say hating or player hating, or whatever you want to say. I hope you don't have daughters. Because you're part of the problem. You're not stopping it. You're not, you're not doing what you got to do to help stop this bullshit. A lot of these females are raising their daughters to be thoughts, man. Jezebel's it, in, Jezebel energy stealing, sucking thoughts. This world fucked up, dog.